This is the Great Kingdom of Gigi, which has a powerful ruler, a strong infrastructure, and a stable economy. Interesting to note, Gigi based their entire structure on the plant cell organelle. For instance, they're protected by natural terrain, which acts like the cell wall and protects the kingdom. Located inside the cell wall, we find the cell membrane, which allows good stuff in, like protein, and bad stuff out, like germs. In our example representing the cell membrane for the kingdom of Gigi is two guards. Gigi's city soldiers represent the chloroplast. The city soldiers captures enemies and turns them into slaves or prisoners. Chloroplast captures the sun's rays and turns it into energy. Mitochondria are the people of Gigi. Both consume food and use it as energy. Next is the Golgi apparatus, which packages protein and carbohydrates to other parts of the body. The GG messenger named Golgi moves stuff to other parts of the kingdom. The vacuole stores food and water for the plant cell. In GG, the dungeon acts as a vacuole, but instead of food and water, it stores slaves and prisoners. And lastly, we have the nucleus, which runs the plant cell and controls it. In GG, a rule controls the kingdom and runs it, making laws and other decisions, and if necessary, executing people.